Welcome back to the channel, back with another exciting Veracity video. This time we're going to talk about Feb because of course this is the month that you guys are all looking forward to. In this video we're going to talk about how high can Veracity climb in Feb and could Veracity make its way into the top 100 in the month of February. So it's all going to be explained in this video guys so make sure you like, comment and subscribe and as always click the bell notification icon so you can stay up to date with all my recent videos. Remember guys nothing that you see in this video is financial advice so always make sure to do your own independent research and with that being said pause the video, click the link in my description and join the telegram group so you can stay up to date with all my recent updates, news updates, technical updates and much much more. So let's get straight into the video guys. So of course I'm going to start off with the percentage gained for the day. So so far, Veracity is down 3.7% so far for the day. Again, guys, this is, shouldn't be shocking. The overall market is just having a brief pullback at the moment. The market cap is $67 million. So the market cap is still extremely small, guys. The market cap rank on CoinMarketCap.com is 330. And this is where things get exciting, guys, before I talk about Feb. So look at this, right? If we go to the Veracity Twitter page, the watch list on coin market cap increased from 371 to 376 between December and January. And the VRA is currently ranked 328 up from 488 during the end of December. Now, of course, that is now 330, but the increase that we've seen since December is incredible. And we do see this trend continuing. Let's continue to the downside. So our coin, uh, sorry, let's continue reading along. So our coin market cap community continues to grow at an impressive rate. We're verified and always on top of the latest updates and developments on veracity. Let's go, the new, it just keeps going on, new exchange listing. Let's go down. Um, as you can see here, most compared coins on coinmarketcap.com this week. Again, Veracity second. Let's keep going and then I'll get into February, guys. Just in VRA, now top 10 purchase tokens among 100 biggest Ethereum wells in the last 24 hours. And last but not least, guys, VRA top trending for the last week on coingecko.com. So I say that to say this. At the moment, Veracity is picking up momentum. And what's incredible with Veracity is the actual technicals are still behind the fundamental data, right? So with a market cap of under 70 million, this thing is still extremely low. I think just to be very conservative with our estimates, we could say at the moment, from my personal opinion, Veracity should be valued at at least around I would say 400 to 500 million dollar market cap. And again, that's me being conservative. I'm not gonna get into the billions just yet. I'm literally gonna be very conservative and say based on what we have in front of us right now, the project, the fundamental data, this to me is at least a half a million dollar project. So the fact that the technicals is lagging behind the fundamentals is exciting. And that leads on to February, right? So what can we expect for February for Veracity. Now, so far it's been an incredible month, up over 200%. Now there's a few things that must occur for Veracity's bullish momentum to continue. And the main you know, factor, the main thing that has to happen is Bitcoin needs to continue its bullish momentum, guys. So if Bitcoin slows down and maybe starts to pull back, who knows, pulls back to around 20,000 or even lower, Veracity is also going to suffer the same fate. So we cannot expect Veracity to, you know, complete a 300 plus percent move or even more if Bitcoin and other altcoins aren't moving. It doesn't work like that. We can back test the, the markets and see that this is very rare that a cryptocurrency will perform extremely well when that, you know, when the overall market is down. So the main thing is we need Bitcoin bullish momentum to continue as well as altcoins and also guys we just need to keep up the the positive fundamental data and i think they're going to surprise us for feb uh, i'm i'm giving the call now i do see a major exchange listing maybe a binance maybe a coinbase who knows i do see that happening before the end of the first quarter which would be before the end of march let's see if this happens either feb or, or early March. This is going to be very interesting to see. 
But so far, guys, I like the technicals, I like the fundamentals, and most importantly, the technicals are lagging behind. So well done for making this far in the video, guys. Now I'm gonna get into some technical stuff and I'm gonna show you where I believe price could potentially go by the end of Feb. And this is exclusive because usually we do this in our Crypto Crew Premium channel. I suggest you all, go, all you guys check that out. Link in the description. Right, you get access to our 100x gems, our latest AI crypto picks, our NFT tokens that we're buying up and much, much more, as well as obviously our long term strategy for veracity. But anyway, guys, let's get straight into the price action. So I, I would say um, let's st firstly start off with the negative. If we do see Bitcoin start to pull back, then maybe we could see a veracity, you know, you pull back 10 percent from where it is now. So let me just measure out a 10 percent decline from where we are now. Uh, let's just go down okay uh, okay let's just say 20 percent max then 20 20 percent i mean 30 percent would be would, would be a very deep pullback but i would say maybe 10 to 20 uh, percent and why do i say that because i do expect um, even if Bitcoin does have a pull, does pull back and maybe start to pull back towards 20,000, I do think veracity will remain stable. So maybe we see a pullback and then we just see price range kind of like this. And then when the market takes off again, then we see that bullish momentum. But even if we do pull back and have a deep pullback, I will be looking to add to my positions, right? For obvious reasons. Now, Let's be more positive now. So let's say Bitcoin continue continues its bullish momentum, um, even though we do have a heavy week of, you know, of, of fundamental data it's from the US that's going to have a significant effect on all markets. So do keep an eye on volatility uh, today in the market. But let's say all plays out. Bitcoin starts to make its way uh, beyond that twenty five thousand dollar Bitcoin. Uh, that sorry that price area then i see this happening i see our first target we move back up to uh the re resistance of this uh structure area that we have here this key area of resi resistance we pull up to that area there which would be in the short term about 70 about a 90 percent move from where we currently are so 80 to 90 percent move from where we currently are and um, i think that will happen fairly fast and then we make our way uh, to at least i think we complete another minimum a 200 percent move again i want to be very conservative with you guys so i'd say we complete another 200 percent move uh, for veracity so we see uh, a move kind of like this right in feb and that's me just being very um, conservative with my estimates. Of, of course, I will update this. Uh, I will continue to let you guys know what happened, especially as you know we will be keeping a close eye on Bitcoin and other altcoins, which will have a significant effect on veracity. But I think we easily complete another 200% uh, percent move minimum in Feb if all goes well with the overall markets. But anyway, guys, that's it for now. Well done for watching the video till the end. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe because I'm going to have more Veracity videos out soon. And don't forget to check out Crypto Group Premium and join our latest free Substack newsletter links below. Anyway, guys, that's it for now. Until the next update, seize the day.